Hi everyone, how's it going? Well, recently I used the 300mm 2.8 VR2, the latest version of 300mm of Nikon. And I actually use it with this combo, with 1.7 teleconverter. When I uploaded the images to my computer, I just couldn't believe it in my eyes. I was like, what? Because wide open, this lens gives me a very sharp image. For those of you um, who are interested in seeing the image, I uploaded the image to my website. And if you still don't know my website, it is biglensadventures.com. Go to my website. Over there on the left, you will see the blog section. And, the blog, and in the blog, you will see the 300mm 2.8 plus 1.7 teleconverter performance. I used the earlier version of this lens, and I think this lens is sharper than the earlier version. But not only that, I also realized that the focus is slowing down only 30%. When I compare this lens with a, another um, Super Telephoto 600 f4, this reduces the focus speed like 50%, uh, whereas this is only reduced 30%. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Nikon hasn't made much change in this lens in terms of look. The weight is the same. It smells the same. They added nano coating and VR, and I think autofocus is uh, a tad faster with this one, and also the teleconverter performance is better than the earlier version. Um, so you've got a 300 millimeters 2.8 and 510 millimeters 4.8 with this combination. I would highly recommend for those of you who wants to shoot wildlife or sports. Um, this combo is amazing and you are still at 3 kgs only and you've got a relatively small package in comparison to other big teles. I mean, check out the 600 for example, right next to this fella. I mean, so there's a big, big, big price, weight and size difference. So, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. Thank you.